Hopkin Field now, Division II regional meet in Dayton. Van Wert's Keegan Hardman coming in with lots of momentum. The Cougar senior set a new district record in the 400, winning by three seconds, and that's just one of four events he qualified for in this weekend's meet. And everybody is welcome at Dayton's Welcome Stadium. Let's begin with the boys' long jump. These are finals of the field event. St. Mary's Dakota McVetty takes third with a jump of 21 feet 8 inches. Four by 800 girls finals. First sales is seventh, followed by Van Wert in eighth. Top four advance the state, so good seasons for both of them. Boys, four by eight finals. Van Wert's Dylan Lotzenheiser, a strong finish. He gets the Cougars a fourth place finish and a trip to Jesse Owens. Preliminary action now in the girls' 100 meter hurdles. And OG's Kylie Schimmler finishes seventh. Van Wert's Landry Kuntz, ninth place. Only one local boy in the 110 meter hurdles. It's Kenton's Austin Baroker, sixth place in the prelims. Girls' 100 meter dash, Van Wert's Megan Braun, seventh. Versus sales Haley Winner, ninth. And let's finish out with the boys' 100 meter dash. Van Wert's Chris Hart just making the cut. He takes eighth and advances on to the finals in that event. Team results from Dayton so far. Just a couple of events in the books. Carroll in first for the girls. Kenton 13th. Van Wert 7th. First sales 18th. They glide at 20th. And for the guys, it's St. Mary's, your highest local finisher right now at 9th. Van Wert sitting in 12th. But lots of action still to come from Dayton.